Hey friends, it's Carrie coming at you from my house. I thought it might be fun to try something a little bit different today. Um, I have got my sewing machine set up and I've been for the past week or so making masks for the healthcare workers in my area. So I thought it might be fun to show you some other parts of my life and show you ways that I stay creative while at home. So I'm just kind of counting these up. It looks like I have, well, I have about um, not quite 40 made already. And it looks like I have enough ready to go for about another um, almost 30 or so, depending how many of these, these little insides I have left. So I'm just gonna get on to stitching them up. So I got all my masks made and I have not quite as many as I'd hoped. I think I have about uh, 60 there, 50 or 60. I haven't actually counted them all up, but I ran out of thread. So that was all I was able to make today. Okay, I just wanna show you one more thing. I just got in the mail that I'm very excited about. I ordered four different international packages that were um, supposed to be shipped kind of at the same time everything was shutting down. So two of those packages were coming from big companies in Canada and both of them ended up getting lost. The companies, I've contacted them, they've, you know, they've sent out another package, and that's fine. The t other two packages were both coming from independent artists in the UK, and I was very, very nervous about them not arriving. Um, if they were lost, these are one-of-a-kind one pieces of art, and if they're lost, I'm just, they're gone. So anyway, I was very, very, I'm still very nervous about one of them, but one of them came in the mail just right now and I want to show it to you. So I got these hand-painted wooden eggs from um, an artist who I follow on Instagram. They're each one individually hand-painted. Oh, they're so beautiful. Look at the details. Um, her name is Claire. Look at, she sent this little hand-painted original wooden egg. So you can't see that. I will put a link down below to my Instagram so you can, uh, to her Instagram rather, so you can check her out. I am, I, I saw these, I saw her making these last year online and I thought they were beautiful and I asked her if she could make me some for this year, which she has, and these are wood so I keep these forever and ever. And I finally got them and I'm so happy and they're even more beautiful in person. So they didn't make it here for Easter but I'm still gonna call this spring. I think I'm gonna build little stands for these and then put them um, on individual stands and then put them in my treasure cabinet. But that is a, another project for another day. <laughs> I hope you've enjoyed this glimpse into my day-to-day -day creative life. I think I might make some more videos like this. This was fun for me, a little more relaxed. If you like this video, go ahead and hit the thumbs up, subscribe, and like I said, maybe we'll do this again sometime. I don't know if it'll be regular, but we'll have to see. As always, thank you so much for joining me and have a magical day.